Good morning, it's Tuesday and it is so dark. I forgot to reopen my blinds after I did some filming yesterday. It's better. It is still so wintry out and I can't even. I know I was like kind of saying I wanted more winter, but I didn't mean snow. Like, <laughs> I just feel like what I wanted was like a sunny, cold day so I could wear my little sweaters and layers and be comfy. But the snow changes everything because suddenly you can't wear like any cute shoes. You just have to like wear your boots. And it's just, I'm just not into it. So it's gonna be a work from home day. I actually have a meeting that I need to be home for. So it works out anyway. And I need to go to the office tomorrow and Thursday. So I'll be there for those days. But I've just started the morning. I started actually a little early today. I had a lot of writing to review and I'm sorry if you're hearing like my laundry and my microwave going. Two different writers had sent in projects for new clients. So it's a lot of like discovering the tone of voice and like working with a writer on a new project is always not hard, but just like needs a little extra time and care. So I spent a little time this morning giving some notes and some feedback and just thinking through some of it and what will make most sense with knowing what the strategy is and what's coming next. So I've sent that off. I'm just reheating some water for my coffee right now. I'm still on my little instant coffee game and doing a little bit of laundry. Well, I'm not, I turned the dryer on <laughs> for some clothes that I hadn't fully dried, but I think I'm gonna pop another little load in. And yeah, I've got just one meeting today. It was gonna be meetings this whole day and they all got canceled except for one. And then I have a meeting, like I said, for my own stuff that I need to do. So I just have two little calls. Uh, and then I have an appointment this evening. Yeah, it should be pretty chill. Uh, ballet last night was so fun. I went to a class. It was really good. I felt like, I don't know. It was, it's, I'm going to like the absolute beginner as I'm kind of working through some like injuries and stuff. And I just feel like it was good. It was a sleigh. I like doing beginner even when I am doing more like intermediate as well, because you just get that chance to keep learning technique. And especially if you started as an adult, I feel like it's important to like slow down and like remember little things. Um, so it was really good. I feel good about that. I came home, Ben and I have been watching Love is Blind. Season six, there's a lot going on there. Um, we don't like any of the couples. So if you do, let me know who. <laughs> um, and then yeah, had a good sleep, got up today, started working and here we are. I also posted my new video, which was trying on everything I bought this year that I haven't worn yet. There was also a couple of things from the fall. It's just like a fun little roundup of like some pieces I just haven't gotten to wear yet. So if you wanna check that out, that is up on my channel. And yeah, I'm gonna get back to work, go get my coffee and just try to stay warm today. Okay, look what my work did. They made us all like cowboys for an upcoming playlist. I haven't seen what the playlist is yet, but that's so funny. That's me. I feel like mine looks like me. Like, I feel like I would wear this. So cute. So funny. Our design team's hilarious. Okay, I'm going to make some lunch now. It's a couple hours later, and I am refusing to order anything out right now because your girl's on a budget. I'm going to make these meatballs from the freezer. They take about 20 minutes to cook. I need to put some foil on this. Ignore my dirty pan. And then I'm going to make some pasta if I have time before my meeting. Otherwise, I'll eat this after and just tomato sauce and i'll probably throw in some like frozen peas or something it's been a busy day but it kind of feels really like not slow but kind of peaceful today is a day with like a lot of writing and like content creation versus a lot of reviewing for me so sometimes those days like if i'm in there writing or i'm giving out writing briefs it just feels a little more calm than kind of like reviewing and quickly getting things out so it's felt pretty chill which has been nice um, I'm kind of excited to get these meetings done. I don't know if you ever feel like this, but when I have just like one or two meetings and they're just like in the middle of the day, I feel like it kind of throws off my day a little bit. So I have that in about an hour. And once that's done and then I have my call after, I should be able to just like refocus on getting everything done today. But yeah, so far so good. I'm looking forward to this little lunch and not looking forward to going out into the cold. It's the end of the day and I'm across town because I've got my appointment. It's freezing cold out and so snowy and I'm parked on like 
the snowiest street, so hopefully my car can move after. Um, and I heard something sharp under there. Hopefully we're fine. It's a little chaotic out, but look at how bright it is. And this is like the same time I usually go for appointments when it's like been pitch black for the past few months. So I am so happy about that. Hopefully in another couple of weeks, we'll be getting some like more normal evening vlogs again, which will be really nice rather than just showing you me in the dark for half of the video. So that's exciting. But yeah, the rest of the workday went good. Nothing to report. Um, and then we're gonna make, I think, a pasta tonight. Ben didn't know I made pasta for lunch and he bought stuff for pasta, so that's fine with me. We'll have more. And I think we'll probably keep watching Love is Blind. And I'm not sure. I think the whole season's out. We are on like the family visits wedding dress portion. So I think we're getting into weddings with this episode or the next one that we've started. So I'm excited for that. But like I was saying, I just like don't really like any of the couples. And usually by this point in the show, at least like one or two of them is interesting to me. And this time I'm like, I don't think any of them should do it. So we'll see how it goes. But yeah, gonna go get this appointment done. Hopefully it's not too freezing out and then get on with the rest of the night. And tomorrow should be a pretty fun day. I'm going to the office. There's like a few in-person meetings I have. And then afterwards I'm meeting my friend Lauren at a cafe because we're gonna work on like YouTube video editing together and I wanna work on some of my thumbnails. I do have a video to edit and I have some thumbnails to work on. So I think that'll be quite cute. I'm really excited to like have a YouTube friend to hang out with and work on our channels together. So that'll be tomorrow evening. I'll try to film a clip and yeah. We're done <laughs> getting back to my car. It is so cold, but look at it. It's still so bright out. This is really exciting. And I also checked, shaking my face. I also checked my YouTube account and I'm at 990 subscribers. So I think I think I'm gonna hit a thousand this week. Thank you to everyone who's been subscribing. It's been really cool to see so many new names come in and new people commenting. And seeing some of you who comment repeatedly, it's been awesome to feel like we're making a little community here. And it's so cute. But I wonder when I'll hit a thousand. I feel like it could happen like tomorrow or Thursday. So exciting. office it's so bright out and so sunny it's only like 9 a.m right now but like i don't know it's just so sunny and i've somehow lost all my sunglasses that i normally keep in my car so i'm not into that the hair trying to decide if we keep this up or not oh well um let's see today off to a rocky start actually i found out today that my podcast client is restructuring his business and we're going to be shutting down the show, at least for now. Um, and I'm so sad about it. Like I'm sad because it's such a joy to work on that show. And I just feel like listening to everything he talks about and getting to discuss it has been so meaningful and so transformative for me. And I'm sad that they're like, I feel like I feel like there's been multiple times I've gotten involved with businesses on projects like this and it's hard to get people to understand how much work and time goes into building like a really strong content model. Like even my channel here, I've been on here for two years. My channel is still not monetized. There's reasons like I could make more content like I've been doing like the try-ons and stuff. But it's not always necessarily like the audience you want that comes in or it's not it's not like sustainable for you necessarily so you need to do content in a way that's like sustainable and true to who you are and like something that will be something you can keep doing so it's always sad when i hear these kind of projects get shut down a because I feel like there's so much time that goes into them and sometimes it's like you're so close to starting to see like a real change with it um so that part sucks and then also it sucks because that was like 20 percent of my income so your girly has to get a little scrappy here i am fortunate that i obviously have a full-time job um so it's not like the rent's not gonna get paid but 
like with the economy even with my full-time job i'm like how do you live just off that i don't know so i need to figure some things out this week and hopefully also like my invoices get paid soon so that i'm at least able to just like get out of any credit debt and pay off things for like my trip and then i can kind of figure it out from there but yeah, a little bit of a rough start for me, but I'm here at the office because we have actually like a couple in-person meetings today and they're all like pretty exciting. So it should be fun. And then after work, I'm meeting my friend, like I said, to go do podcasts or to go do um, like vlog editing together. And I think that's going to be really fun. So there's the good and the bad, but I just hate March. Everything bad happens in March. I'm also wearing my new pants. I kept the bigger ones, I just wanted the extra length, and so far I'm happy with it. Yeah. I'm heading to meet Lauren now, we're just going to a cafe. Until I'm at 9.97. Such a nice little work session. I um, actually got a lot done and it was just like so fun to chat YouTube together. And now I'm gonna head home, get some dinner, probably take a bath. I think that's the day. Good morning, I only have like a second because I need to hop into the office with a meeting. I actually have a lot of meetings today. But we hit a thousand! We hit a thousand subscribers. It happened last night. I was watching Love is Blind with Ben and then I just checked it and I was like, ah, and I like totally freaked out. So thank you to everyone who's been subscribing. That's really exciting. It's just like a cool milestone, you know? It feels like, it feels like there's a lot of people here. I know not like a thousand people are watching every time, but that's still wild. So thank you to everyone who has hit subscribe and kept watching videos. I have a pretty busy day ahead, so I'm like really excited about it, but it kind of comes on the heel of me also like losing that client. And it was just like, how did two things like that happen in the same day? Like I lost my biggest client, but also hit this like milestone I've been working toward for so long. So it's cool, but it was kind of like weird. I was like, what are the odds? And then today's just a really busy day. So I feel like I can't like really process <laughs> today. Um, I have meetings all day. I'm also going to be on our live show today. And then I have appointment, like an appointment across town right after work at 530. So that's going to be tricky, but the weather looks a little better. So hopefully driving's okay. But yeah, we've got two new clients we're speaking with today. So wish me luck. And before we get into it, you celebrated a huge milestone for your own content. I did. I hit my first thousand subscribers on YouTube, Woo! which is exciting. It's just around 2.30. I've had calls most of the day and I'm so tired. So I'm going to go find some coffee because we have another call. It's the end of the day and I am just heading out because I have an appointment. And I'm so tired. I like cannot get it together today. I've had like physio stuff. I've had multiple coffees. It's just not doing it. Now I have to like drive across town for this appointment. And I feel bad because every week I see this like physio. I'm just in the worst mood because it's right after work. It's at like rush hour and I'm always so tired on Thursdays because it's just so busy. But it was a good day. We had some really cool meetings with potential new clients. One was like kind of a PSA initiative and then one was an artist. So it was just really neat. And it was just good to see everybody. We got donuts because we had an in-person meeting. That was nice. And it was good. Although 
I did drop down under my thousand subscribers. Um, so hopefully that recovers so I can keep riding that high, but it was good. I did the live show as well. I just feel like I'm in a blur right now, honestly. So I'm just going to get going. I will see y'all later and hopefully this appointment is good and then I can get home and maybe go to bed early. <laughs> Okay, I have to say that was better than expected. I feel like I was also just like mentally <laughs> in a better place today. So I'm done now. It's I think about 6.30 or something or 6. Yeah, it's about 6. And I'm gonna head home. I think Ben and I were gonna like um, just hang out, maybe get a drink, celebrate my little thousand. But now I'm under a thousand, so we'll see. Maybe I'll do something tomorrow if it goes back up. But I'm just like exhausted. I feel like you can see it in my eyes today. It's good. It's good that like we work so busy. That's not why I'm tired though. Um, I just like didn't sleep very well last night. I really woke up a few times and then I'd catch myself laying there awake and I'd be like, why am I awake right now? Because I'm normally someone who sleeps really well. Um, historically in my life, what is going on? Anyway, I'm gonna head home now, see what Ben's up to. He was seeing a friend, so I'll see if he's back. And then maybe get a drink, maybe chill. I didn't know last night that what we watched was the Love is Blind finale. I forgot that like so many of the couples like didn't broke up and stuff i thought there was going to be another episode so it is what it is but yeah i'm gonna head home chill and be done with <laughs> this busy day tomorrow i'll work from home i think but i think we have flooring people coming in so we'll see how possible that is if it's too crazy i'll go to the office and then we'll see i haven't heard from my client about if we're finalizing our last episode so as of right now i think i will be working on that but if i hear otherwise then i won't be so i'll just see happy friday i think i'm gonna end this vlog here i'm back up to just over a thousand subscribers so i'm gonna end up before i jinx it again and it goes down but Ben got me the balloons yesterday that I shared and a little card and he got a champagne. So we're gonna have that today. It's just cute. We have like, we like to celebrate in this house. And I am just about finished the work day. I think I've got about another hour, hour and a half of work and then no plans tonight. So I think it's just gonna be a chill evening at home. I might play a game on my Switch and then probably take a nap, honestly. So I'll start a weekend vlog, but thanks so much for being here for this one. Thanks for helping me hit this milestone this week. It's pretty exciting. And otherwise, if you haven't subscribed, please do. I'll see you again very soon. Bye.